Papyrus. Ah, hello, Undine. Can we just be friends? Why can't we be friends? Why can't we be friends? Ah, uh, goodbye. <clears throat> hello, everyone. Welcome back to Undertale. This is part 14, I think. Quite possibly. And we're continuing where we left off of being chased by Undine and this very peculiar tentacle in the water, which I really don't trust. I mean, if all those who've seen tentacle porn know where this could go, but I mean, I'm not, my character's not old enough for that shit. So let's can just continue on. I don't trust this. Uh, oh. What? 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 Uh, what? What? Some onion squid from anim from fucking Japan? What, what the fuck? Hey there, noticed you were here. I'm Ongen san you here? Um, hi, um... You're a little derpy-faced, um... You're visiting Waterfall. Huh, it's great here, huh? You love it, huh? Yeah, me too, it's my big favorite. This thing's creepy, I don't, I don't want to see if it actually has like an angry face or not. Even though the water's getting so shallow here, I have to sit down all the time, but hey, that's okay. It beats moving to the city and living in a crowded aquarium, like all my friends did. Okay, I get it, you're you're lonely and you're socially awkward, um, but just try not to go psycho on me. And the aquarium's full anyway, so even if I wanted to, I... That's okay, though. You hear? And Dean's gonna fix everything, you hear? I'm gonna get out of here and live in the ocean, you hear? Well, that's a fine idea. But it'd be, I don't know, it's kind of weird. Hey! There, that's the end of this room. I'll see you around. Have a good time. In Waterfall... Okay. A little strange. Huh? The fuck is this thing? Shiren hides in a corner, but somehow encounters you anyway. Is this out of shyness? Tone deaf. She's too ashamed to sing her deadly song. Toot. Uh -uh. I think you need more optimism. But I wouldn't want to hear it if it's deadly, but I will hum. Um, I'll smile at first. You smile. You ask to see Siren smile, too. Siren gets quieter in the corner. Aaron nods his head approvingly. Where's Aaron? That horse thing is, like, watching me like some kind of bro or something? Um, Siren pretends to be a pop idol. Um, conduct. You hum a sad song. Siren follows your melody. Siri, Siri, see me, see me? Sharon seems much more comfortable singing along. Um, well, I guess that's it. Oh, okay. You earn 30 gold. Okay. Apparently Aaron was watching for some reason. The northern room hides a great treasure. And what's this sign say? This power has no counter. Indeed, a human cannot take a monster soul. When a monster dies, its soul disappears. An incredible power would be needed to take the soul of a living monster. Interesting. There is only one exception. The soul of a special species of monster is called a boss monster. A boss monster's soul is strong enough to persist after death, if only for a few moments. A human could absorb this soul. This has never happened, and now it never will. Ah, wait. Probably still could. I mean, maybe the genocide run would mean I have to do that. But I'm not an asshole. X equals quit. Okay. A haunting song echoes down the corridor. Would you play along? Well, the first eight are fine. Um. What? There's a piano here. Play it. Yes. Um. What? I... hmm... Only the first eight are fine. Hmm. I'm going to try... 
Let's see. If I do... Nope! Okay, I have no idea. I have no piano sheets to understand what I'm supposed to play on there. So I just played a jam for no reason. Huh. What are you? It's a statue. The structure at its feet seem dry. How peculiar. Please take one. I will give the statue the umbrella. I want to be nice to the statue. Here you go, statue. Yes. You place the umbrella atop the statue. Inside the statue, a music box begins to play. The music continues and doesn't stop. Oh, uh, wait, I get it. This could be for the piano. I can't... Oh, my... Okay, I'm gonna have to maybe take my time and figure out what to do to play the piano, so... You'll have to excuse me as I go figure it out, and this might take some time. Alright, I think I got the freaking tune down. It's been a while since I've been just like, hitting the tunes and making it so it sounds all equal. So, it should actually just be... Uh... Yes! Okay. There we go. I totally did not cheat for that piano lesson. Uh, what is this? It's a legendary artifact. Will you take it? Sure! You're carrying too many... What? What? Annoying dog, a little white dog, it's fast asleep. You put the dog on the ground. But, no! The dog absorbs the artifact! Absorbs? You little bastard! Seriously? I did all that work, and the dog steals it. Fucking serious, he absorbed it. What? I already read that, what am I doing? I d after all the... Well, I'm at least happy I made the statue happy. Even if it's an inanimate object. Yes, I will take another one. Hmm. Or even. Uh, do you need an umbrella? Yo, you got an umbrella. Awesome. Let's go. This is somewhat adorable, too. Can I talk to you? No. You're not even under my umbrella, technically, but... If you stayed closer to my side, I mean, you wouldn't get so wet, but... Man, Undine is so cool. She beats up bad guys and never loses. If I was a human, I would wet the bed every night. Knowing she was gonna beat me up. Ha ha. Yeah, very, very nice. Great to know. So, one time, we had a school project where we had to take care of the flower. The king, we had to call him Mr. Dreamer, volunteered to donate his own flowers. He ended up coming to school and teaching class about responsibility and stuff. That got me thinking. Yo, how cool it be if Dean came to school? He would beat up all the teachers. The teachers are bad people. Interesting. Um, maybe she wouldn't beat up the teachers. She's too cool to ever hurt an innocent person. So what, I'm not innocent? Oh, what is this? Hmm. Uh, hmm. Why are you running ahead? Um, hello? Oh, well, that was a little weird, but okay. Hmm. There, now you can grab an umbrella. Put back. Since there's a bucket of umbrellas, you would think that this isn't like a take one and keep forever, but it's just for a scenario. This will. The rain will stop soon. Yo, this ledge is way too steep. You wanna see you Dean, right? Climb on my shoulders. Wow, that's really nice of you, buddy. Even though you're such a fan of Undine, 
You go on ahead. Don't worry about me. I always find a way to get through. Still adorable. The humans, afraid of our power, declared war on us. They attacked suddenly and without mercy. The serene sound of distant music box. It fills you with determination. Hmm. In the end, it could hardly be called a war. United, the humans were too powerful and us monsters too weak. Not a single soul was taken, and countless monsters were turned to dust. Very sad tale, but it's... It's what was expected, really. I'm expecting I'm to be fighting with Undine any time, and I... I was fearing a boss fight in the past. Oh, God. I was trying to avoid the situations... Uh-oh. 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 Don't tell me I haven't forgotten about... Oh, God! Fight Undine. Yeah. Hello, Undine! I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna, you know, run. Uh, no thank you. No thank you. Your aiming's getting worse. Nope. Yeah. Uh, no. Uh, where am I? Oh god! Oh god! Getting a little faster. Oh god! Oh shit! That, that's. I'm not even sure if I'm going the right way, but I'm going like. Oh. I'm still going this way. Oh shit! Mm. Oh god! Mm. Oh god! Ah, oh, this person is relentless. What's up here? Oh god. Oh. Jesus. Oh god, more. I'm amazed I went in the right direction, but I'm guessing there's multiple ways to get here. Uh, uh, um, uh oh. Um, let me guess. He's waiting at the end. Or she. Papyrus? Ah, oh, hello, Undine. Can we just be friends? Why can't we be friends? Why can't we be friends? Ah, oh, goodbye. Uh, it sounds like it came from over here. Oh, you've fallen down, haven't you? Are you okay? Here, get up. Nico, huh? That's a nice name. My name is... Huh. Is that the, the squid person? Wait, I'm in the water? What? What? Hmm. Oh, okay, I get it. It's all water. Huh. What? Piles of garbage. There are quite a few brands you recognize. Just garbage. Hmm. Interesting. I'm going to have to leave it here for this episode and continue on later, because I don't know what's going to happen and I'm all out of time, so... I hope you've enjoyed this story progressed type of episode so far. We're actually we're learning more about the history of what happened between the monsters and the humans. If you want to learn more or have anything to say about this kind of interesting history, please leave in the comments below. But I hope you've enjoyed, and until the next episode, this is the soup you want. Try it for yourself. Oh, just wandering. Looking for my coffee. Where will I? God damn it, flashlight! I don't like moving without my flashlight on. It makes me feel more secure. <laughs>